Hello, this is Andrix Bear, this is a beer review. Firstly, apologies, it's been a little bit of a while since I last did a video. Been pretty busy, I was down in Manchester last weekend for the football and also got to go to Cloudwater, which was good. But back to the rough and tumble of beer tubing. I'm back with a beer review and I promise I will start being more regular with these. But anyway, today's beer is from Five Points Brewing Co. It is a bottle of their Railway Porter. It is a 330ml bottle, 4.8% ABV. It is a porter, as the name suggests, with aromas of chocolate and coffee with hints of caramel, brewed with East Kent Golding Hops. Uh, this was actually part of a box I bought from Beer 52. It was 20 beers for 20 quid. Most of them were sort of close to their, eight, their best befores. Basically, I have to say it's actually 10 days past its best before, but with it being a dark beer, it shouldn't matter too much. So let's crack it open and see what it looks like. It smells delicious straight away. Getting lots of sort of chocolate and coffee. So it's sort of pours dark brown, it isn't completely black. There's definitely sort of like a hint of brown in there. A nice sort of tan coloured head. A couple of fingers. Get the whole thing in. There we go. It's only a free fame old bottle. I should be able to get that in a glass okay. So so yeah, oh that smells beautiful. Tons of chocolate. Touch of coffee. And I don't think there's any drinks around in this. I wouldn't think so, I'm only being five points. I think it's just, yeah, I think this is all the malts and hops doing the talking here. But yeah, it smells so chocolatey. Bit of, with a bit of coffee. Perhaps a little bit of licorice as well. Dried fruit. That oh, smells beautiful. No, I've heard, I haven't had too much from Five Points, but I've heard good things about this beer. I've heard it's a very nice porter. So let's dive in. Oh yeah, lots of lots of maltiness. The chocolate is nowhere near as prominent on the taste as it was on the smell. The coffee, however, does is more prominent on the taste than it was on the smell. Yeah, the chocolate's sort of in the back, a bit more in the background. The coffee sort of comes to the forefront a bit more. Yeah, lovely malt profile. There is a slight hoppiness on the Goldings. Quite nutty as well. And the body's pretty decent actually for a 4.8% porter. I mean, it's not thick by any stretch of the imagination, but there is a, there is like a little bit of something there. And it's got a sort of nice sort of silky mouthfeel. Well, that's good, that. It's a nice solid part of this. 
Oh, but I bet it's absolutely awesome from cask. Got a good finish. It does linger. No, it's just really, really well brewed beer. Just, yeah, just a proper, like, classic old school porter. Just. Yeah, really nice. Yeah, five points. Uh, based in Hackney, London. Unfiltered and unpasteurized for a better flavor and aroma. Yeah, like I said, it's a uh, ten ten days out of date, but it's absolutely fine. Like I said, dark beers are not you don't have to worry about too as much about things like that. You know, unlike your pale beers, where you ideally want to be drinking them as close to the candle date as possible for that sort of real sort of fresh hoppiness well this has got a hoppiness to it yeah it, it, it's it just yeah it still maintains its character and flavors and yeah that beer you just yeah you don't have to worry too much about dates as much obviously if it's stored well you want to if it's you know if it's stored in some warm like high light environment and maybe it would wouldn't be tasted so good but if it's stored well i mean that beers yeah they last for ages so anyway nothing about storing beer and <laughs> best before and dates to rate the beer up yeah it's just a lovely solid straightforward porter lovely notes of sort of Coffee, chocolate, malt, a little bit of licorice. Yeah, decent body for its ABV. Nice mouthfeel. I'm going to give it a 4.25 on untapped. So yeah, 4.25 for Railway Porter by Five Points Brewing Co. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Check out my other videos. Follow me on the socials, on Instagram. Instagram, Sam Drinks Beer YT, Untapped, Sam Drinks Beer 93, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.